The African Union Commission Chairperson, Mr. Musa Faki, has expressed his concern at the violence that ensued after Azimio's public protest in various counties in Kenya. In a statement sent by the Addis Ababa-based organization, the chairperson decried the loss of life, damage to property, and the interruption of economic activities in Nairobi. He called for calm and urged all stakeholders to engage in dialogue to address differences between political players in the supreme interest of national unity and reconciliation. With regard to the reservation raised against the conduct of the August 2022 general elections, Musa Faki reiterated that the exercise was a success and was later confirmed by the Supreme Court after the petition by Azimio Coalition. The statement came at a time when the Azimio Laumoja Coalition vowed to continue with the protest despite the hurdles placed by the government in its attempt to contain the situation across the country. Both sides of the political divide also proclaimed a firm stance, ruling of the possibility of a handshake between leaders despite calls from a section of the clergy. Since the onset of the anti-government protest, one person was confirmed dead, according to the information provided by the National Police Services. Scores of political officers deployed to manage the protest were also injured in ensuring skirmishes pitting them against the protesters. Now that the African Union Commission chairperson, Mr. Musa Fakim, has expressed his concern at the violence that ensued after Azimio's public protest in various counties yesterday, do you think it's high time for President William Ruto to sit and talk with Raila Odinga?